there's a time where alikuwa so lonely alikuwa na feel so lonely so left alone so akawa na depression cause nilikuwa hapo hivyo ugonjwa ukianza by the way uh, it was at one point tulikuwa kwa gym na eh so all of a sudden i can akwa kona gym hapo hivyo kaketi akaanza kufikiria a lot and then i was like hey mom what's up ni nini nafanyika akanema tu relax so akafikiria sana hiyo sikuwa ku train tukaishia kwa hao jioni hajafanya anything akaenda kashawa aka relax hapo kwa kiti akingojea sapa akakula akaenda kudo the following morning that silence so ni kama alikuwa anaenda to depression pole pole without us even noticing but mimi nili notice nili notice ni vile tu nilikuwa myang sikuweza ku kumpata hizo mawaidha like uh, a mature adult would uh, personally do oh uh, actually her last uh, match the title was the queen of africa versus the queen of the world so na wali fight mara mbili so the first fight it is a mekanani draw queen of africa which was conchisina cheng queen of the world which, which was a natasha ragozina so ilikuwa wa germany walipelekana wakasema ni draw but according to uh, people's opinion alipokonywa hiyo vita ilikuwa ashinde by the way nime watch several times konjali munda Mambo vipi karibu kwa mara nyingine kwenye Plug TV your number one infotainment channel kama kawaida this will plug you with every trending story leo tumekutana na bondi ya mambo mbaya vipi bro ah, poa sana poa sana, poa sana. niko fresh barida yani <laughs> yani unakuanga energize 24/7 unakuanga energize 24/7 uko unajua kwa msewa sports lazima uko na energy bana mm -hmm. so energy ni kitu kwa like we really have to be energized all the time mm -hmm. and uh, like, yeah yeah like that is it. Oh some call ambao kujui maybe buji tambulisho unajulikana kama nani? Um kwa jina um the one and only Charlton Otieno mm -hmm. uh, the uh, son to uh, former boxer Conjetina Cheng well known famous boxer. Mm. Yeah. Uh he doesn't she doesn't need further uh yeah, clarification. Mm. We all know who Conjetina was mm. and uh she's still a champion. Yeah. So that's my mom. Awesome, awesome. Yeah. Well, G, Charlton, uh, Charlton happens to be my... Can I call you my friend, Tanguzama? <laughs> uh, well, I'm, I'm not this guy for uh, like uh, the, all the way from when I was young. Uh, yeah. I remember this guy, we used to train with him at, uh, in uh, Umoja Inako. Yeah. In uh, Congestina Wild Gym, we, yeah. we used to have a gym where we used to train. This guy was there, man. Nice to meet you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, now, uh, uh, yeah. True, true. Yeah. Now, Charlton... Uh, kiendelea so far kazi yako ya ubondi na kupelekaje so far ah uh, lately sisi sema like uh, it has been a journey mm -hmm. unajua boxing kwa na mwana sport it, it's a journey mm -hmm. so mimi kufika hapa penye imefika leo mm -hmm. it has been a journey mm -hmm. so we all know uh, what uh, happened mm -hmm. and uh, just talking on myself uh, still uh, mm -hmm. uh, i've really i've been working hard to reach where I am today. Mm -hmm. I've been training, I've been practicing. I started training boxing at the age of nine. Mm -hmm. uh, I used to be trained by my mom. Mm -hmm. She used to be my trainer, she used to be my coach, mm -hmm. she used to be my mentor. Mm -hmm. So I'm mm -hmm. a train until it reached a point where she left the ball on my court and I, I, I had to be alone, self-independent. Mm -hmm. So she could give up, mm -hmm. try here and there, I could go to the gym, I could go to the gym, I could train. Mm -hmm. And uh, so lately I've been training, I work as a personal trainer. Mm -hmm. I train uh, young upcoming uh, uh, boxers. Mm -hmm. I, train, I train youths boxing for self-defense. Mm -hmm. I also do a uh, full body workout. Mm -hmm. So in other words, I'm just a, a trainer. Yeah. Awesome, awesome. Now, Charlton, to can lea ku kuangale vile on a tupa mi ndondi uko na kule. Is it something that you wanna pursue professionally ama ni kid run tag for maybe hobbies na kitukama? Um it has always been my dream uh, which is a boxing professionally. Mm -hmm. But you know, you are still as mtu wa mkangi tu once alafu wa nasema today I'm playing boxing professionally. Mm. It's a matter of steps. Yeah. Lazima kuna tu hizo stages you have to go through. Mm -hmm. And uh, without enough support, support system, awezi. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. So, mimi nime kwa nikitaka kuchiza boxing mm -hmm. kama professionally. Mm -hmm. But uh, lately, sija niseme ni opportunity imekoseka na kidogo. Because mm -hmm. you know, kuna changa moto za hapa na pale, the ups and downs. Mm -hmm. Uh, so it doesn't me fanya bad but um, I still have hope mm -hmm. na train na I understand na na lewa like uh, no hard work goes unpaid mm -hmm. so niko na hopes that uh, one day one time mm -hmm. 
I'll reach where I want to be. But meantime, I'm still training. Uh, I'm just training to myself. I'm keeping fit. Mm. I reach to various trainers. I sharpen my skills so that they, when that time uh, reach, eh, mm. it will come and sour and I'm ready to go. Nice one. Charlton mwenyewe hapa na tukiendelea kuzungumza zaidi. Uh, so far tangu anze training yako umekutana na maybe na mabondi wenzako mkingia kwa ring mkoona kiwango chako cha ubondi kimefika wapi? Ah uh, nimekutana na mabondi wengi sana uh, professional uh, boxers. Nimekutana na kina Fatuma Zarika, Rayton Okwiri, uh, watu wa ma promoters wa box, boxing pia kama kina Sugar Ray. So nime meet nime say. But sasa uh, you see when I meet these guys uh, mm -hmm. it is always wise like I need uh, I, I ask for advice mm -hmm. as a young upcoming professional boxer mm -hmm. or aspiring professional boxer mm -hmm. what is it that I'm not doing that I should start doing mm -hmm. ama no, naomba ile wanielekeze mm -hmm. so all the nimekuwa nikamboa like you continue training mm -hmm. just train harder like your mom used to train mm -hmm. so nikisikia hizo hizo motivation mm -hmm. I don't lose hope I continue training, I continue training. Nimefanya sparring na kidogo. So at my rating, sa hiyo kinipatia 1 to 10, ndasema niko 8. Hizo 2% zimebaki, zita kam nikifika hiyo professional boxing. Yes, so, yeah. Na, kwa, kwa mda mrefu tumekuwa na history kwa mba Kenya, high support mabondia kama zamani. Do you feel that's true? I don't know whether to say it, it's a myth or a misconception. But uh, in, uh, okay, if you look at that at a certain uh, angle, it might be true. Because of lately, to, to kona very passionate boxers who mm. want to pursue boxing as a professionally, mm. but you, but uh, kupata yo na fasi, at a, I've, I've met gyms by the boxing gyms, uh, you find that we do, the boxers, they lack uh, gym equipment and facilities. Mm. I wanna iso training za iso to za train za kutosha. Alafu na patapia sa zingine these boxing matches, eh? Most of them are not supported by the government. In as much that as we rely solely on the government, wanna support bo wanna support football, rugby. Like ineki fiko pande wa boxing ivi kidogo. Mi upanangu ni kisema the moment konja li aliata na boxing your design. Miss Jessica boxing, Gina boxing, tena I kinuka like ili ili die. So in my opinion, not bragging though, but na feel kama konzeli na na boxing, cause whenever she used to to fight, I get angaza call stations, TV zote, radio, na ugeo na wasewa meja palivo kuwa stadium, wamenda kuwache match, wasewa me show na wasewa me chrome. Like in squeeze man, una skia boxing, una skia ta like akuna ni kitu ni kama I let the impact kwa mse, ni kama ili die. So personally, me nikona hopes. Na sema there's one one day, one time. Ata kama ni mimi, ama my colleagues will tutakuja kuwa msha yo jina boxing. Cause it is a sport like any other sport. Now, na uko maju, boxing is, is high ranked. Actually, it is among the top sports uko ju. So sembu se uko Kenya. So kindly, uh, the government na juwa tu mewa nini tu mawanea sana like gava 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 sa idea hii. Like ini sporting sporting is, is it's important. So uh, specifically speaking about boxing, Tafadali let us support boxing. We have uh, very uh, passionate uh, boxers who like to pursue this as a career mm -hmm. and we are letting them down. True. I'm one of them. Boxing is my passion. I train every day and uh, it's just that the support is mm -hmm. not there. Mm -hmm. So come up with a particular support mm -hmm. from the government. It's a shukuru sana. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Na ukiangalia kuna wakati ambapo story ya uh, your mother ilienda viral watu wakaweza kujitokeza wa hisa ni wema uh, Jay, did your mother receive the help that people promised to to give her uh, speaking about that to me it's normally some uh, it used to be a story about my mom Konjisina Chenga it used to be a sad story but nowadays it is no more it is not a sad a sad story to me because uh, I stopped living in denial. Mm. It is a fact that she, she was mentally sick mm. and there's nothing can do about it. I'm not going to blame anyone whatsoever because mm. uh, what's our idea? Mm. And mostly I'd like to thank all the Kenyans. Mm. There's a time we've opened a platform for fundraising for Konjesina Cheng and Matibabu. Mm. Kenyans wali jitokeza wali raise. Mm. So nkwa amesaidia konje sana, siyezi mlaumu, amesaidia. Mm. 
like so many people government so many politicians mm. wame idea so i'm not blaming anyone mm. lakini inasema tu like uh, the last time i checked uh, tulimpeleka alikuwa tu hapo hivi Nairobi uh, certain rehab nimesaujina kidogo but then uh, when we i personally went there to discharge her with uh, some of my colleagues my aunts and uh, unfortunately we didn't have prior plans for her like after discharging her what then agepatiwa nini agepatiwa kazi fulani kazi fulani anze kutenisha like akuko na good plans za nyakisha tuka huko kwa usi atafanya kitu kama hiyo maka job so tulim discharge there being no any other option alitaka kuenda kurudi home so kwanza alitoka usi kama ko saa of course uh, kuna that post treatment plans wanafanyanga so alitoka huko kosi kama ko 70% so the remaining 30% akipatiwa hiyo post treatment plans pia kufanya job ndio ile fire that was the initial plans but plans didn't go as uh, we had expected so ile bidi konze amerudi home and then uh, sadly enough unajua kwa home ako idol and then akikuwa idol hiyo sasa anaanza kufikiria vitu mingi which leads to depression depression alafu stress and then boom hiyo ugonjwa tena inarudi so currently she is still uh, mentally sick at home in Nyanza and uh, the condition is still the same so but so yeah that is it that is it now uh, would you want maybe uh, what was uh, when leo kumsaidia kiplani according to me konje ni mse aliacha legacy so rather like uh, ku to history ya my mom thing eh nikikuwa tu fellow nikikuwa tu kama fellow citizen kama civilian Konje was a good fighter, was a good boxer, and you find that, that whenever she went to the ring, she didn't go like she didn't go to fight. Alienda ku entertain my fans. Una get? Konje alienda pale hivyo first round back a six. Alikuwa na chapa tu ma movement hivi ma kidodge dodge, aki entertain my fans. Wase wa cheki eh ujamaa kuna skills. Alafu kifika round hiyo 8 nini anachapa ke hiyo unaona? So ni msa alikuwa alikuwa msa anategemea my fans sana na aliacha liga sikonja linua jina bendera ya Kenya juu kabisa ule ule pata time yote akienda kucheza majuu uh, Germany Steto alikuwa akibeba bendera na ile zile songs alikuwa anaingia nao kwa ring zilikuwa za Kenya una get so hapo you know chiki Kenya inatambulika alafu akakuja kanao jina ikajulikana kwamba like the queen of africa is from Kenya so konja alifanya a lot so sahi hata ni seme like uh, me according to my own opinion wase wa fake lose hope najua tumesaidia sana lakini umejaribu kari ya uwezo wenu wase lakini we never personally i believe that uh, you don't have to give up so konje is an icon na jina bado iko mtu mdogo ana grow sayo kumwambia konje ni nani atakwambia konje anajua konje so hiyo jina ndio nataka ni maintain kama mimi niko na that responsibility i need to maintain that name but still if possible kama kuna mse bado ko willing kumsaidia cause inawezekana we just need to take her to the hospital and then post treatment plans and then plans afterwards akitoka OC ni nini na hapa next tunampatia ka job kajima hapo hivyo boxing ni kitu iko kwa damu so anaweza trainisha ma youth boxing ama wase hivyo hiyo design like kitu ya ya, ya kumkeep busy alafu i think that will be well so kindly let us continue supporting if by any chance you guy someone is outside there trying to figure out how to approach i'm here let us support congestina yeah awesome naona jua kuna maybe watu walikuwa wanafuatilia wakijaribu kuuliza uh, ulijaribu kufuatilia ukauliza ni nini kilisababishwa your mother to fall sick kitu kama hiyo um the cause of sickness hiyo eh? haiko guaranteed eh? but uh, according to wase wengi hapa inze wanasema ni as a result of boxing yeah. wengine pia wako na version yao yenye maybe starterja yeah. but uh, ugonjwa ni kitu haina kinga ni kama tu ajali haina kinga yeah. so but what i can assure you guys the citizens conjes illness was not as a, as a result of boxing yeah. tumekupata boxers wengi wame fight like Mike Tyson uko majuu yeah. but hawajako asiki your design So ugonjwa tu ni kitu ile come from nowhere cuz unapata konje ni msali kwa na jelewa kikwa ring alikuwa like alikuwa na aji protect all the time hizo za mapanje za kichwa alikuwa akizidodge all the time so 
alafu pia akiwaosea kifanywa x-ray hakuna brain damage yenye inaweza sema ilikuwa ni punch kwa ngumi kwa kichwa there's, there's nothing wanapata kana tu brain iko sawa so we, we fail to understand but uh, ju ugonjwa tayari kwa hapo hivyo tunasema tu like uh, maybe ni there's a time where alikuwa so lonely alikuwa na feel so lonely so left alone so akawa na depression cause nilikuwa hapo hivyo ugonjwa ukianza by the way uh, it was at one point tulikuwa kwa gym na eh so all of a sudden akina kwa kona gym hapo hivyo kaketi akaanza kufikiria a lot and then i was like hey mom what's up ni nini nafanyika akanema tu relax so akafikiria sana hiyo siko ku train tukaishia kwa hao jioni hajafanya anything akaenda kashawa aka relax hapo kwa kiti akingojea sapa akakula akaenda kudo the following morning that silence so ni kama alikuwa anaenda to depression pole pole without us even noticing but mimi nilinotice nilinotice ni vile tu nilikuwa myang sikuweza ku kumpati hizo mawaidha like uh, a mature adult would uh, personally do so hiyo hivyo ndio ugonjwa ikaanza the next day akaanza kusema vitu vya ziko like maybe someone is hallucinating unajua unasema msee eh kuna wasi wana kam kukuchukua come to jificha hapa hivi so una get anaanza kusema hizo stuff hizo stuff lakini si atuliwa anasema nini so ikaanza hivyo pole pole so hivyo tu kidogo kidogo aka wasenika rizalam kwa my relatives home aka wakakama akamchukua akampeleka madare that was the first place she was taken alafu hivyo tu hiyo ugonjwa ikaendelea tu ika spread to your design ika kwa tisa ni kitu hiko so personally siezi jua ni nile ya ugonjwa na pia wasewa elewi but it was not as a result of boxing uh, ukiangalia pale sana wengi wanadai kwamba uh, the last time that uh, she was in the ring alipokonywa ushindi wake na tangu apokonywa ndio akaanza kukua ni kama ameanza kufikiria sana could that be the, the cause Oh uh, actually her last uh, match the title was the queen of africa versus the queen of the world so nawali fight mara mbili so the first fight ili semekana ni draw queen of africa which was conchisina cheng queen of the world which, which was uh, natasha ragozina so ilikuwa wa germany walipelekana wakasema ni draw but according to uh, people's opinion alipokonywa hiyo vita ilikuwa ashinde by the way nime watch several times Konjali munda. So ikasemekana Natasha alikuwa ndaka rematch. So Konjesi akakubali. Yaani ule mse. So wakaenda rematch. Wakapigana only to come up with the judges wa kujana decision uh, points za Natasha ziko juu. So wakasema Konjia me lose. So I think after hiyo pindi za kunachangia juu sasa you see that all, all that effort kufika hadi hapo hivyo alafu unanyanganywa points pia ni za kwa email lead to that kwa sasa after hapo hivyo unaenda because by the way hiyo ndio ilikuwa vita yake ya mwisho after kurudi sasa Kenya huku hivi ku relax relax dogo ndio hizo stuff zikaanza sasa so i think pia hiyo stress na kufikiria sana about that ala inaweza kwa email lead to that yeah tukimalizia sana ningependa kuuliza wewe unaweza waambia nini wahisani wema kwenye maybe wenye wanataka ku support kibondia mabondia hivi uh, my opinion uh, what i'd like to say kwanza ningependa ku advise map coming boxers manze never give up kama ni passion uko nayo fight fight it out work towards your dream uh, manze hapa hivi lazima ujitume kwa uh, lazima ujitume by the way cuz me personally i'm self independent sina support from anyone i fight my way kama hapa hivi god ameni bless na talent talent ya boxing na train wa say boxing for self defense I do personal training na train wase. So you know na hiyo ni kujituma. So don't don't just see to see kati hapo hivyo tu lose up and z. Secondly, boxing requires discipline. Manzi kwa na discipline you will go far but kama wewe ni uko na talent ya boxing lakini hauna discipline, ah my my guy, my guy. Like you can't go anywhere. So discipline discipline comes first. And then finally uh, to the upcoming boxers this uh, mostly generation year to year eh? tafadhali let us focus on boxing let us raise to to tafute jina boxing kwenye lipotelea huko nyuma to raise tena uh, le, continue practicing kama mimi na, na train daily in and out because i understand there's one day one time uh, not magic really but something great is going to happen unajua hata mungu anasaidia those who help themselves so endeleeni kujituma 
and uh, God willing, all is going to be well. So maybe Neza Ambia, your design must you give up. Because if you give up, who is going to take care of you? Akuna magic, akuna chakulita jileta kwa nyumba kwa tie boom, magic has happened. No. So just be you and uh, do what you can do. The left, the 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 rest uh, live for God. Yeah. Na kuna yiswali watu wangipenda au kujua. Wewe kama boxer, you are already out there making moves. Kumekuwa na wezekano maybe different countries that are going to project sema you are wasting your career come change your citizenship and become a boxer kitu kama hiyo have you ever considered changing your citizenship <laughs> that's a tricky question but naweza sema ni changamoto pia cause it is true eh mimi mwenyewe nimekuwa niki train boxing in different places na nime meet wase wengi wase ukamu unajua kuna watu wa promises na kuna watu wa PR mtu atakuwa approach eh hey, mazeni mwanako sawa kama yeye msee wengi sana wameni approach eh hey, Charlton i can see you can box so well your mom used to be a great boxer kama hivi tukifanya fanye fanye hivi alafu tunakuwa show taita kwa saa ah tunafanya hivyo design msee ametoka hiyo design so ni vitu pia siku hizi nime like lazimu kwe mjanja ukiongea na msee lazimu pemu msee ako na mawitha poa ama ako na bad intentions so nime meet msee but uh, the last person i met alikuwa na good intentions ni vile sasa niko na the challenge the, the guy was willing to take me abroad ama kunitoa maju ni catch the boxing kwa hivyo maju uh, which uh, plans were underway but come to think about it unajua sasa hii hata masa ako home hmm? konja ako home na saa zingine ni mimi anategemea hii kidogo natengeneza lazima nitume home kiasi nguo so i was imagining nikishaenda maju uh, who is going to take care of my mom yes ako home ako na family yake huko lakini at some uh, kidogo i also act as the breadwinner unaona mm. alafu pia uh, kuna that mother and uh, son connection yeah. na feel kama in this in this state yenye yako alafu niende ma, niende majuu naona ni kama nilikuwa nimemwacha unaona mm. so na, na jaribu sana it's a cha, it's a big task to me but uh, sahi kwa sahi i prefer fighting for my country kenya because mm. that is where she also started mm. rather than going abroad mm. so but i'm um, guaranteed that uh, ile siku nitakuwa sure mama ko hosi mm. ako sawa neze na maju mm. nipigane nirudi that is when kama jina box itakuwa imeshafika penye na fake wa kuvi kenya mm. but uh, kama jina box ta kwa imeshainuliwa hiyo design who am i i love my country and i'm proud to be a kenyan nitapigania mm. inchi yangu kama mom na nitainua jina nitainua bendera ya kenya mm. and i'll be undisputed by the mini pro. Yeah, Mi hata sasa nikinya kwa ring. Unaweza Ah, naweza mseke yo mapa kati yo design. <laughs> <laughs> siku brag, siku brag ni fact. Uh, ni fact. Ni ukweli ni kwa hiyo ana test. Now, uh, uh, sasa sijui watu wanaweza kupataje kwa kwa mitandao kijamii. The people that maybe want to support you uh, boxing wise. Um my social media platforms, uh, Instagram Charlton Otieno. Ah uh, ukifungwa tu hiyo Charlton Otieno tuna buy hapo hivyo Konje Junior. Uh, Facebook Charlton Otieno uh, Twitter Charlton Otieno Mimi mse tu uh, like uh, real jina tu ni jina so Charlton Otieno kila mahali utani get yeah Wazi wazi huyo alikuwa ni Charlton Otieno one of the best boxers in Kenya umemuona tayari mtu anajua kutupa <laughs> misungu yuko na kule sina mengi ya kusema you can leave your thoughts on our comment section pale na kama unaweza msupport pia unaweza mfollow pale instagram na alafu angalia ile kazi anayofanya if you also need a personal trainer he got you covered keep it locked kama kawaida this is plug tv your number one infotainment channel see ya